what's up everybody it's me a i'm back with another video a i'm back again a back to back made back stock to ms We're about to do another tutorial a get your at facts let's go a get your at facts let's go a open ae and let's go on your pc or your macbook it doesn't matter it's whatever a. ready to help again a a help again a I'm back to back, 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 help again. Hey! I hit that. Don't lie. Do not lie. I hit that. Say words. Say, stop the cap. You know I hit that. Stop the cap. Welcome back to another tutorial. Today we're going to be, I'm going to be showing you guys how to do the cube split thing. You know. <laughs> yeah. So you already know the drill. Get your picture. Get it ready. Crop it. Pre-comp it, all of it. We're gonna go up to our tool, plain old thingy, and we're gonna select the rectangle tool. Actually, we're just gonna double click it and then turn our proportional grid so we can make it proportional, you know? We're gonna select this and we're gonna click it and hold shift and drag it down to this one right here. We zoom and make it sure. Look at how perfect that is. I did that. Look at this man. Anyways, duplicate this layer and we're gonna double click this. Press it, hold shift, and move it to the top. And then zoom in to make it perfect. Okay, you can turn off your proportional grids, and this is how it should look, everybody. Change the color, just so we can make it easier on ourselves. We're gonna need six sides of each of the layers, so we're gonna duplicate each of them five times. One, two, three, four, five, five. We're going to turn off this layer, and then we're gonna work on the first half to the active camera and we're going to change it to custom view one we're going to make sure to turn on our 3d layer for all of the clips so for this we are going to want to use new y rotation and we're going to set it to 90 and then we're going to put this one right here make sure your snapping is on right set this y rotation to negative 90 then we're just going to move this one up and snap it like so like that for the bottom two we're going to double click and we're going to remove the mask so this will be the top and the bottom this one we're going to use the x rotation and we're going to set that to 90 snap it to the bottom first so we can see the top to 90 as well and we're going to place this one at the top press c on my keyboard so i can get the camera and make sure everything is fine so now that this one's done we're going to turn the eyeball on for this one and hide the first one and we're gonna do the same thing to change the view back to active camera we're gonna place three null objects the bottom clip is going to be parented to the null as above we're gonna make that a 3d layer turn motion blur on for the clips these clips are going to be parented to the top null and then we're going to select these two nulls and parent it to the very very top null make sure everything is 3d layered and make sure your clips have motion blur on it we're going to select this and zoom it out And then you can press position and rotation on these two nodes to do whatever transition you want to do. Break it apart, rotate it. I hope I could help. If you have any questions, you know where to reach me. Instagram, the comment section, my Discord server, whatever you choose, whatever you decide, that's on you, my fam. Make sure you follow me on Instagram and TikTok and my Twitch because I'm streaming, y'all. Be a part of the stream, you know? And if you have any other tutorials you want me to make, just let me know and I'm going to try to do it. And I hope you guys have a good day, good night, good evening, and afternoon. And until next time, I'll see you guys later.